Hello again, guys. It is 3 a.m. My time. This is roughly when the reveals come out for me. So looking to refresh this page a couple times. All right, so we have a Targon Star Spring, two mana landmark card. Round N, heal damage allies one. Then once I've seen you heal 22 plus damage from allies, win the game. <laughs> oh, that's brilliant. That is brilliant. Okay, realistically, allies doesn't include your face, by the way. So heal damage allies one, and then if this landmark has seen you, heal 22 plus damage from the game, uh, win the game. Brilliant. Gonna have to protect this landmark at all costs. Spring gifts, fully heal an ally. Okay, Tom Kench, I see, I see what's happening here. Where's Soraka? A uh, spring guardian. A uh, three minute three three when I'm summoned, create a spring gifts in hand. I believe Spring Gifts was a card that we just saw before, right? Correct. Correct. And are we just going to get the three cards today? No, nope, we have one more. Fast Speed. Divergent Paths. Draw a landmark or destroy a landmark. Oh, shit. Okay. Sorry if my webcam's in the way. That's a pretty fantastic card in terms of like these landmarks. That's a very powerful Targon card. That's actually a very insane card. If like landmarks become very popular, Oof. Targon is gonna oh, wow brilliant absolutely brilliant at least now we have an answer to that free old landmark card that people aren't too happy with all right real talk though we're gonna need to see more cards before we can really justify how easy it is to do this already though you can like okay so assu assuming Sorak is gonna come with some healing stuff how possible is this to do because you need to protect the landmark. I'm guessing you could put like spells on the landmark to protect it. I'm not actually entirely sure. Like, can you bash in landmarks? That's the real question. It's actually, it's actually, I just realized Spring Gifts is not a collectible card. And hasn't got the icon there, I just realized. So Spring Gifts is always something you find from other units. Spring Guardian seems pretty fantastic for this heal. I think the biggest highlight here is Divergent Paths. Another very serious removal tool that's going to be limited to a certain region, which is going to be Targon. Alrighty, so Star Spring is clearly the showcase card here. And now the real question is how effective, how effectively easy is it going to be for us to heal damaged allies? We're gonna to need to have like lots of units on the field. Um, obviously these new build water cards have some synergy. Suspecting Soraka to be around the corner. I think Star Spring wants to be in a deck that is fully committed to playing its strategy because it's the ultimate win condition, right? There's text that reads uh, win the game. So when you build a deck with Star Spring, it's going to be heavily, heavily targeted towards this card. So I guess the next question is how do we protect Star Spring? And if removing landmarks is only limited to cards such as Divergent Paths and a few others, then it might be quite difficult for people to deal with it. Uh, they are going to be mostly uninteractable, these landmark cards. So this, yeah, obviously any card that says something like this is going to have high potential. Um, seems like a very interesting card. Seems like a card that would shake up the meta too. Um, and if you, build your deck, if you can build your deck around this card without uh, sacrificing, like, I don't know. It's going to require some uh, pretty intense deck building, I think. And only the five head players will be able to make this work if it's possible. Anyway, guys, that should do for now. I don't think I can really get more into Star Spring without seeing some more cards. High potential. Probably going to see lots of play. Whether or not it will be meta is the real question. Anyway, I will see you guys tomorrow. As expected, no champion reveals today. Uh, tomorrow, Soraka. So get ready for that.